And that's the sheep sit instruction. And you've got to say sit very clearly because they misinterpret your instructions. So that, ladies and gentlemen, is how the sheep is sat two shearings a year. Spring and autumn, they have one or two lambs and produce five years. Then they're sold. And the end product of this type of animal at that age, mutton, going to the other island as spring lamb. <laughs> so that's how they're held. So now, let's put her in position. And I know you can see that under here, that wool, not good value. So it is wise to separate the underside from the better wool and then get on with the job. So let's do it. So starting on the brisket, we work quietly, quite hard to that little bit, and then away we go. So this sheep, to us, stays in the valley, whereas the merino that stays in the mountain, with the legs through. Now come down this side as well, because we need the wool off both sides. So this type of animal is a good of producer you'll get, and per lamb, $130 what we're getting. So that works out good. Now tidy up. Grab the tail. We can get clean because it's a while again before she crunches. Lean out and along. Come on back. Work our way down. Right there around. And now you'll see where we're going. See that wall coming up pretty good. So this part of that wall we're choosing in the better country. Making her more economic. Put that back so she's decent. Now bring her up. And we're going to put it quietly up the neck. Leaving the head off. You know, I learned at university in my second year of economics that if this animal did not have a head, you'd have no wool production. <laughs> so you can learn a lot of useful things, and that's no wool. Now we work out quietly. Shave under her arm, and now we get away from the messy stuff by suiting her and letting her sit just like that. Round we go, quietly getting the wall off. So this shape is all right down here. Now we step over and work right up. But down the last side. We like to leave that ear on. <laughs> the reason if a sheep wiggles a lot, you need to whisper in her ear to make her behave minstrel. When <laughs> she hears minstrel, it behaves itself. See how she's enjoying it? <laughs> Always good to see a happy sheep. Because happy sheep grow more wool. There it is. Now, down that last little bit. So, ladies and gentlemen, the mountain, brilliant wool, not the good meat. But in the valley, great meat. And not the good of all. So there it is. Nature and make us choose the best 
Thanks very much.